Good morning, dear students. Today's lecture is uh, for the first year student English department at Helvet University, assistant lecturer Hajar Mahmoud. Today we are going to discuss Unit 5 from your textbook, Real Listening and Speaking by Miles Craven. Unit 5 is entitled, Is There Anything On? Here with our regarding to with regard to this question we are going to deal with films. So is there a new film to discuss? Can you convince me with it with a film to watch? Can you comment on a film? etc. So in this unit we are going to describe films, comment on films. In addition to films, we are also going to see what is meant by news and how can we predict how can we give or uh, brainstorm a list of words regarding predictions on a news? First of all, describing a film. The first step to describe a film is by describing the type of the film. And on page 26, you can find a list of types of films listed in number one or in the brown, brown table in page 26 which is in an exercise the type of the films, the film may be a comedy, a horror movie, uh, a science fiction war, thriller, fantasy, action movie, romance, etc. so different types of films the first thing to describe a film is by describing or to give the type of the film. The second is to talk about the plot. With regard to the plot, which is the main idea, the main events that happen in the um, movie, to comment on them or to describe the plot is to comment on it. And comments can be positive or negative. This will be further discussed in the following slides. Now the third point is optional. You can either give some names of the characters, the name of the uh, director, which you may prefer and know that others prefer, so you can add such names. If you don't, it's okay. So the main characters, you can say, for example, Brad Pitt is stirring, or Brad Pitt is the hero. You can say Brad Pitt and Leonardo DiCaprio are starring in the movie, etc. So this is with regard to the subscribing the film. The second step is to give comments. Comments are two types. If you like the film, you give positive. You give positive comments. If you don't like it, you give negative comments. For example positive comments are like heartwarming, well acted, original, believable, etc. Negative comments which you use in, in case you don't like it is for example boring, predictable, too long, ridiculous, etc. For me if I didn't like a film I can say all these no. negative no. comments. No, if I like the film and I want to convince others to see it, I may also give all these positive comments. With regard to the comments, you can find them on page 27 at the left top. Suggesting a film. To suggest a film, you can use one of these three structures. First, you can say, I suggest you watch and the name of the film you can say you should watch and the name of the film you can say why don't you watch and the name of the film so any one of these three can be used to suggest a film however after telling the name of the film you can comment or say why you suggest that that film for example you can say it is a hit its effects are breathtaking, or the plot is awesome, or heartwarming, 
or you can say anything about the film. However, um, back to the point, you can use any one of these three structures. Now we move on to news. News are generally brief and they continue some important details, some numbers, and the main things about the news, the main concepts or the main lines you can find in any news is that it has a story and a topic. The main topics in any news can be either the news is talking about an entertainment, sports, politics, economy, culture, science, diseases as nowadays with the coronavirus, etc. So these are the main topics found in news. You can also find them on page 29, right at the left, right at the left top. So, uh, with regard to story, which is the main important details, numbers, a brief summary of the news, you can start with the news is about. For example, the news is about coronavirus. The news is about uh, global coronavirus. The news is about... Um, for example, some natural disaster, a hurricane, military action, etc. Then you give some important details, numbers. For example, uh, earlier I have seen a news on the TV that 700... Sh see, I'm going to give you the story. Uh, it was about coronavirus. It discussed how many people were uh, dead due to coronavirus in Iran. There were 700, about 762 people were uh, killed by the coronavirus uh, and another 13,000 affected by it or carried the virus. There are hopes to be well and cured. So this is the whole story about about it. When we hear the title of, um, of a news, you, we can do what? We can do predictions. We can predict. Uh, and in news there are always pauses between one topic and another. So when uh, uh, these uh, topics are uh, orderly presented to the viewer or to the listener the listeners can predict or brainstorm a list of words regarding what is the news talking about with regard to this picture if there was for example a news with this picture uh, this is an Asian man, man Mumkin Ikon from China, North Korea, I, I can't tell. Uh, behind the man, who is wearing a, a protective mask, uh, the, um, the map of Asia with a, sh a corona or a virus shape, red uh, corona, where, where it is uh, in Asia so I can uh, predict the news I can uh, predict that the news is about China's economy China's coronavirus the death since Taban red refers to something mumkin perhaps bad uh, such predictions my predictions may be different from your predictions so most of the subjects uh, in your textbook real listening and speaking depends on your real experiences depends on your way or your style in speaking how to comprehend uh, such a news and how to produce some predictions about it so this is a, a very simple uh, example 
for you to help you uh, give some uh, predictions the predictions I want is just like this a list of words nothing more nothing less thank you all for watching thank you for listening